All right. Get to chill in the back seat today. As we go fly up to Steamboat to get a little bit cheaper gas and more importantly, pick up some beer. But uh, we'll let Christina finish her run up and we'll get up in the air and on our way. Here we go. How we get rolling? Woo. Let's do it. What do you think, co pilot? Huh? What do you think? You want to go flying? You want to go get beer? 36 at this time. <laughs> I do not see a problem. With okay, it. sit down. Thank you. Good girl. Eagle Tower, good afternoon. Skyway 90872 Echoes holding short at 25 at Bravo 3. We are a VFR northbound departure with Sierra. I guess Betsy's going to join me back here. 72 Echo, be around there two minutes away for wake turbulence from that Party King Air full length. Uh, we can wave it if that works for you. It works for me. Now we're 72 Echo, runway 25, intersection Bravo 3, clear for takeoff, right turn out of the north proof. 25 at Bravo 3, clear for takeoff, right turn out of proof, 72 Echo. I told you I was feeling it. <laughs> That's definitely a Betsy fart too. Ah, damn, Betsy's. That's how you reward me? You give me a big old fart? Oh, let's do a big 180 really quick. Keys? Got keys to go get fire. <laughs> <laughs> David, mission what do success. we got? Almost mission success. Just gotta get home. That way we can crack these bad boys open. And what did, I don't know, Christina picked them out. Got the hipster doofus, always a good one. Double IPA. We got the ma uh, maestro, Indian pale ale. Almost just pronounced that wrong because I can't read. <laughs> um, then we got the chowda, the one we've been talking about. And drop them. We got the urban sombrero, the Mexican style lager. There we go. That plane right there is what I used to fly. Christy used to fly for work. Uh, yeah, no, but really, I used to fly that. Back in 2018, 2019, boutique air trip down memory lane. Woo. Now, we're flying the 182 back. Come on, Betsy, let's go. Come on, me. Successful flight today from Christina. Yeah, <laughs> it went really well. I'm stoked on it. And got to hang out in the back seat, which is actually pretty nice. Those windows, it's, it's like super full panoramic comfy views. Back there. Yeah, so. I know it's kind of nice getting to sit back there every once in a while. Definitely. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we went up to Storm Peak, 
grabs a couple four or a couple six packs of their delicious beer. Mm -hmm. um, having kind of a a more, I guess you'd say, just straight up flight in the hangar. Yeah. Four open cans of beer, no taster glasses, but we look forward to going back up there and doing a more proper flight tasters and maybe talking to one of the brewers or owners and getting to hear their story a little bit because they do make delicious beer. Some we've had before, but you know, we'll go back into them because they're, they're all so good. So. <laughs> All super delicious beers, man. They never disappoint. Thank you, Storm Peak Brewing, for delivering the craft. That's for sure. <laughs> most definitely, um, most definitely. So if you're at Steamboat, go check them out, for sure. We're all about showcasing aviation and the craft beer community. So follow along and see what see what we have to have to show. Yeah, look forward to digging into both of those communities more and more, but till the next flight. Till the next flight, yeah. Cheers. <laughs>